Tonight, we venture into the depths of darkness to a party like no other, a graveyard party. But this isn't just any Halloween celebration. Legendary monsters, creatures of the night, have been invited to a ghostly gathering they'll never forget. Will they survive the night? Or will they join the spirits forever? Let's find out. It all begins with a mysterious invitation. Dracula, the vampire prince of darkness, Frankenstein's monster, the gentle giant, and the mummy, ancient and wise, all receive a summons to the party of the century. One night only, for creatures of the shadows, a graveyard party, and despite their differences, each one feels an unexplainable pull toward the haunted graveyard. As they arrive, the graveyard is bathed in eerie green and purple light. Fog creeps between twisted tombstones, and hollow eyes stare out from the darkness. At the entrance gate, a sign reads, Welcome to the Graveyard Party. But little do they know, once you enter, the spirits may not let you leave. Inside, strange, silent figures gather under flickering lights. Skeletons, ghosts, and shadowy figures from beyond the grave wait, as if frozen in place. Dracula's gaze sharpens. Frankenstein looks around, fascinated, while the mummy shuffles nervously. But suddenly, the skeleton musicians begin to play. And with the first eerie note, the guests come to life, welcoming our monsters to the graveyard party. Dracula, of course, is the first to take the dance floor, moving with a hypnotic rhythm that seems to mesmerize the crowd. Frankenstein, eager to join in, clumsily steps into the groove, swaying back and forth. And the mummy, well, he's keeping to the shadows, watching with suspicion. But then, oops, Frankenstein's heavy foot accidentally crushes a tombstone, causing a cascade of chaos. The skeletons tumble, and the ghosts scatter, sending shivers down the spines of our monstrous guests. But not everyone at this party is here for fun. One of the graveyard's oldest ghosts steps forward, a flickering blue figure with hollow eyes. He warns them. When the lights go out, this party ends for all but the living. For the rest of us, the night has only just begun. Dracula raises an eyebrow. Frankenstein glances nervously at the flickering lights, and the mummy tightens his wrappings. As Dracula shows off his hypnotic moves, the lights start to dim. The green and purple glow fades in and out, and the fog thickens. The partygoers' faces turn from glee to panic as they realize, if the lights go out completely, the spirits will be trapped here forever, and our three monsters might be as well. With no time to waste, our unlikely trio must work together. Frankenstein lifts the mummy up high, giving him a chance to reach the ancient, flickering disco light. Dracula uses his supernatural speed to dart around, guiding them and protecting the lights. The mummy stretches out his bandaged arm, reaching for the bulb, and with a last burst of energy, he manages to twist it back into place. The lights glow brightly once more, and the party is saved. With the graveyard party back in full swing, the spirits cheer for their new friends. Dracula, Frankenstein, and the mummy exchange a knowing look. They've survived the night, and maybe, just maybe, they've made some new friends in the afterlife.
As they leave the graveyard, they promise to return next Halloween. Because, after all, who can resist a graveyard party? Thank you for joining us on this haunting adventure. If you loved our night at the graveyard party, be sure to hit subscribe and join us for more thrilling tales and spine-tingling stories. Until next time, happy haunting.